morning guys it's been a while it's been a minute how's everybody doing this morning it's friday how's everybody doing it's good to be back guys it's been a tough five or six weeks personally but uh, god is good God is good. How's everybody doing? My phone keeps sliding. I'm doing well. I'm doing much better. Definitely, I definitely have a lot to share with everybody. Been through a lot the past six weeks really been a challenge but uh, God is good once again and I was able to overcome everything that uh, was set out before me so yeah guys God is good that's all I can tell you what's the plans for the Friday let's hear the pipes <laughs> soon man Good to have you back. It's good to be back, guys. I guess uh, you know for the past. Uh, well, I guess for the past uh, four weeks. Uh, well, not four weeks ago. I'd say like six weeks ago. I couldn't even speak. So that is why uh, you've seen me like MIA on uh, social media, not posting pictures of myself or Dizel. Uh, just you know basically just posting my trading results and and all of those things uh, because like I was unwell and Dizelle was unwell and my whole family was unwell so you know I was just trying to recover but yeah there was this there was this in a in that space of uh, six weeks I'd say for about uh, two to three weeks or maybe even, even four weeks I couldn't even speak properly uh, yes I did have COVID I was diagnosed with COVID on the six, sorry, not 16th, on the 19th of July. So on the 19th of July, I uh, it was a Monday morning. I uh, about 2 a.m. I woke up. I just had uh, a headache and uh, body pains. So I went for a test, tested COVID positive, and then it was it was just hectic. Uh, seven days into COVID, uh, my chest uh, be- became infected. And I couldn't breathe, and uh, and I had all of those complications. There was parts uh, in time in that uh, in that period where, you know, I thought I wouldn't make it to actually see another day. And it really, really was hectic, guys. Let me just hold the phone up. Yeah, it, it really, really was hectic for me. Um, it it's it's I have no words. You know, at that time you question everything. You you you. Question whether you can make it. You question your confidence, your courage. But one thing I, that I never did is I never questioned God. And I always had my faith that the Lord would get me through it. And uh, yeah, I had the infection. I couldn't breathe, and uh, I was about to go to hospital. But uh, because of <coughs> you know, uh, how can I put this? But because of what's been happening lately and uh, I just refused to go to hospital and I said that you know what I'm not going to go to hospital and uh, I chose not to go to hospital and uh, I'm not saying that if you go to hospital you're not going to make it through uh, COVID but I chose personally that I don't want to go to hospital and I made it through just just by uh, just by like you know uh, taking some heavy, heavy medication, going under oxygen. Yo, the accident here right in front of me. So done, guys. I'm on the wrong lane. Yeah, so it was really, really hectic. Thank you. What a kind person. Yeah. So, um, it was hectic for me and then... Uh, 
I finally recovered after that and then I still had complications with my chest and all of these things and then uh, it's about uh, four weeks in COVID so from the 19th, 19th of uh, July uh, four weeks after that that I actually started seeing some good recovery but uh, guys it's not a joke it's not a joke I'll share more of it but I'm just thankful for God and to God that you know he got me through I think I've faced some of my darkest days um, in the past six weeks you know just just struggling with my health and uh, throughout those the last six weeks I traded every day God gave me the trend uh, the strength sorry to uh, to trade every single day and uh, to just get through the day I traded every single day in the past six weeks well not six weeks I'd say uh, four to five weeks out of the six weeks I traded and I took trades in bed I never got out of bed I stayed in bed and uh, I took all of my trades in bed with my laptop right in front of me because I had no strength and uh, the complications that I had with my chest I couldn't even like walk because it, it just it just wasn't good but uh, yeah guys God is faithful and uh, I got through it and here I am now I'm, I'm, I'm fully recovered I just have uh, uh, have the cough that comes out uh, now and again and uh, sometimes I do uh, grasp for breath and that's post COVID uh, uh, symptoms and uh, sometimes my speech does get slurred as well and like now it is and my throat and mouth gets dry like now but other than that uh, yes I am I am well recovered the Zell is well recovered and uh, family as well we did have uh, some losses which I'll share about in terms of the family but yeah guys all is well and together with that my Instagram got uh, hacked about two weeks ago uh, and uh, you know they say when it rains it pours and that's what happened but got through it uh, I went for the vaccine last Sunday uh, my first dose of the vaccine and uh, yeah we're doing well guys just focusing on ahead pushing forward I have a forward focus and you know we just want to kill it create future millionaires and uh, just just enhance the people not only financially but spiritually you know throughout this whole process I guess what was revealed to me more than anything else was my purposes and the purpose that God has for my life and it's only when you have an encounter like this where money cannot help you when you have COVID guys money cannot help you I'm telling you guys I had COVID and no amount of money could help me nothing could help me no, all I could do is place my trust my faith in God I maybe have lost uh, in that period of time I lost faith in myself lost confidence in myself but I never lost faith in God and he helped me through and uh, guys it's, it was just a really challenging time that is why as I'm saying again I haven't been posting pictures I haven't been posting much content of myself maybe of my traits I have uh, but th- that is because I uh, I was I just went to, to through a period where uh, I was just suffering in terms of my health and you know what they say your health equals your wealth and I never really um, knew what that was until I was until I got hit with COVID and I just saw myself deteriorating every single day uh, after the seven day and I actually thought that I wouldn't make it through you know so many things passed my mind because I couldn't breathe. There would be uh, times in the night where I would just wake up and my chest would be locked in, uh, and I couldn't breathe. And uh, and that's the reality of it, you know. But uh, God is good, guys. Uh, oh, I can just give Him the glory. I can just give Him the glory. That is all I can do. I can't take anything for myself. Nothing we have is our own. Everything belongs to God. Our life belongs to our uh, to God. And in the period of COVID, all I could do is I just surrendered myself to God and I said, you know, uh, let your will be done. If you want to see me through this, because I was in a very advanced stage of it, see me through, Lord. And if you don't, then uh, then that would be fine too. And God's ways is not our ways, guys. And, and uh, He saw me through it. So yeah, that's basically what's been happening, guys. But I just jumped on here 
onto this uh, onto this uh, live this morning just to just to tell everybody you know that it is me who who has control of my account Josh Naidu SA and my backup account jmoney.sa uh, we, I do have uh, control of both these accounts. I am posting on both of these accounts. Uh, I am answering the DMs on, on both of these accounts together with my admin team. Just to give you a surety guys that I am live. I am back. I am kicking in action. And I've never been out even throughout uh, the COVID, even throughout being uh, COVID positive. In the worst of days, I still traded. There was days guys where I literally was was going to the doctor because I couldn't breathe and I sent out a signal in the morning. That is why uh, I don't know those who on my signals group would have noticed there are times uh, during uh, the last five, five weeks sorry my speech is getting uh, slow but anyway uh, there they are there are times in the past five weeks where I was sending signals really early in the morning like 5 a.m. in the morning which I don't do but that is because I was on my way to the doctor at that time and I saw an opportunity and I took the signal and I sent out a signal and took a trade. But throughout the five And all glory to God for him giving me the strength, you know, to, to, to still trade and empower people and, and, and fulfill my duties in, the, in, in this time. You know, a lot of people when they have COVID, they just put everything aside and say, you know what, this is it for me. But I never lost hope. And that is why I'm yet. Today I'm here to give you hope that guys even when you're in COVID you can fight through it just surrender yourself to God just take the necessary things that you need to do just do what you have to to make sure that you're okay you know and you will get through it guys you will get through it and uh, many a few thousand people will watch us live after this and I hope that you be empowered as well because you know what here again guys what I've what I've encountered and, and gone through, I was in a really advanced stage of COVID where I couldn't have made it, literally. It wasn't mild symptoms, it was really hectic symptoms. And uh, I overcame it. It doesn't require money to overcome this. It doesn't require money, to, money. It requires number one, you need to have a strong mindset. You need to be planted in God. You know, things like that. But I'll share more of that uh, on the next live, guys. This live was just here to... The purpose of this one was just to, to show you all that, you know, the real J money is alive, well and kicking. And I am in control of these accounts. Uh, both my J money, uh, dot SA account and my Joash Naidu underscore SA account. It's me, guys. I'm here. I'm well. And I'm here to empower you, encourage you for every day that I have here on earth. Whether it's 40 years left, whether it's one year left, I don't know the plans of God. But I will be here to encourage you, to empower you, and more especially to create future millionaires. So I'm going to end this uh, this uh, live now, guys. Just running a, a bit out of breath and my speech is getting a bit slurred. But yeah, probably on Sunday or in the day, to, a few days to come. I'll do another live where I'm just going to share my process for the past six weeks, what I've learned and how I can help you moving forward. So stay blessed guys, stay safe and take